what's up guys so today we're doing a very simple standard button sheet using material.io so um, we import or add the library to our project right and then so for bottom sheet behavior right it is applied to a child of a coordinate layout right so first of all you need to convert um your layout that you want the bottom sheet to be in to a coordinate layout right and then we create a child a child view right a child of a coordinate layout so over here we say maybe we use um frame layout and then maybe say the height to be 450 dp and then we set the height to be match parent right so we need to add um the behavior right the layouts behavior and which is app layouts behavior then search for the first one bottom sheet behavior right so now it comes downwards so this will be your bottom sheet right so um let's add maybe an image image view let me see the width is 70 dp set the height to the wrap right let's let's add the image okay so sets the image to remove our request is why we won't we won't actually see it right now so let's go and add um the background for the frame layout right so background at drawable then let's call it rounded right so great actually we want it to be shape my selector okay. and we add a color to it solid sorry solid color one purple have a color to it then let's add um corners to for the edges right so corners top right or maybe top left so let's do for tdp and do the same thing for the top right as well for tdp so now we see the image but uh, the image looks very small because we need to do scale type to be center crop right then we do gravity to be center sorry then top center yes so this will save as your bottom sheet right and you now go to the code to add a few lines of code right so we say bottom sheet behavior dot from forgot to set the id of this frame let's name it sheets right so from sheets then dot apply now we set the peak height right to be 200 so this will be the height that would display just at the bottom before you swipe the bottom sheet so we set the peak height then we set the state to as well so see this dot state to bottom sheet behavior dot state collapse right so it collapse the bottom sheet is visible but only showing the peak height right so it only show just a small bottom a small bottom sheet that will show why we run the application then you see what i'm talking about right so we said so this is the peak height right this this small height that's showing the bottom sheet 
that's the peak height so we set that one to 200 right and we set the collapse so the collapse is if the bottom sheet is visible right the bottom sheet will be visible but only showing the peak height so we want this to actually show right when we swipe then it would um fill up with the height which we set over here which which was for 450 db right so that would be the bottom sheet so you drag it down then it comes down drag it on top it goes on top to add um the content for your bottom sheets right in the frame layout because it's the frame layout that has the behavior of the bottom sheet so that's where you add the content right so you see i'm just doing content of bottom sheet 